All right, so um, good afternoon. All right, so hello to all the football viewers out there. So Femitech actually here once again. We're going to catching or capturing the match quarterfinal match between Clarendon College and um, Central High School. And of course, this match is being played at the Foga Road High School. So this is quarterfinal match between Central High School and Clarendon College. Right, so again, much being recorded by Femitech. So for those persons who are new to the YouTube channel, definitely remember to click on that subscription button because by subscribing, you will be notified once an great Femitech video is up there. So again, quarterfinal match between Central High School and Clarendon College and of course these are two Clarendon teams alright so here we have the teams walking onto the field and of course they are led by the match officials so of course Central High School in their traditional dominant brown of course with white socks um clarendon college would have changed their jersey they are in dominant blue of course um for group of 16 and the first round they would have been playing in the gold outfit or if you want to say the yellow outfit so they are completely different in terms of um their jersey so dominant blue would just um, yellow or uh, gold strike. So, of course, um, Clarendon College is expected um, to take this one. Um, the person is already calling the game. Definitely, uh, Clarendon College. Guess what? The ball is thrown. Of course, you would have realized that the defending champion is not here I mean that um, the defending champion would have um, exit from the round of 16 so definitely have some upset going on so in terms of um, direction the central high school will be kicking to uh, the east while um, Clarendon College will be kicking to the west. And who is this a come over here saying at 12? No more yet, more you fix it in the square. So here we go, match officially start now. So ball limited upfield by Clarendon College. So of course Clarendon College is known for using the length and width of the turf so, um, ball dangerously in front of the Clarendon College goal. Now, let's see what Central I make of this free kick. Um, exactly on the 18 yard line, it seems, in front of goal. So, um, of course, Central I is known to play high pressing game. 
while um, Clarendon College is known for their passes. All right, so the player seems to be okay. That the player that was full. So Central High with a free kick dangerously in front of the Clarendon College goal. <laughs> Alright, so quite sure that Central not gonna sit back for this one. So here is Cynthia with the first kick towards goal. It's a free kick again. Exactly on the 18 yards line. So here is the central line. So two players over the ball. Uh, number 10. It's a five-man wall, so here is Central Eye with a free kick. Right, and um, ball booted over the crossbar, so um, Central um, definitely never made that one count. Um, actually wanted a better kick, so here is Clarence and Kalis now with a back kick. So again, match being recorded by Femitech. There is Clarendon College in the middle of their seat. Of course, they are known to pass the ball across. Alright, so as you can see, Clarendon College want to pass the ball on the turf foot. I'm quite sure that quite sure that um, Central I'm not gonna allow them to play the free flowing game. <laughs> So the score is 0-0 zero, zero after about four, four, 4 minutes of play. Fucking idiot! Relax, 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 Kale. Right, so, um, Clarendon College putting some passes together looking dangerous just a while ago. So um of course Clarendon College is known for passing the ball and the turf using the triangle format in terms of passing but I'm quite sure that central
Again, the score is zero zero. Watch what that is, watch what that is, watch what that is, that is it, man. Very good, very good. 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 Very and so Central are not settling down, they're just um, turning over the ball. Get back, number four, get back, number four, get back. So Central High School with their second free kick, um, not deep at the top of the Clarendon College Park. The more dangerous team again, the score is 0 0. About 10 minutes of play, again the score is still 0-0, zero zero. again much being played at the Foga Road High School. So for those persons who are new to the channel, please remember to click on that subscription button. Definitely once somebody upload a video, you will be notified once you subscribe to the channel. One boy, one boy man, one boy, one boy, one boy man. Come on, 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 come on,
comfortable as they normally do because this central eye team definitely is one that play really high press football so of course Clarendon College is the crowd favorite persons are expecting um, Clarendon College to win this one comfortably I'm quite sure that reaching this stage um, central high school must have some quality so not gonna be an easy match for this Clarendon College unit again CC in the blue dominant the blue and gold while Central High School in the dominant brown and white so again much being played at the Fuga Road High School recorded by Femitech so for those persons who are new to the channel definitely you need to click on that subscription button So after 15 minutes of play, the score is still 0-0. Zero, zero. So Clarendon College again look like the better team. Clarendon College is dangerous in front of Cole. Still Clarendon College. Yeah, 
Definitely. Pressuring this central unit, but um, the defensive line for central is rock solid. Um, Clarendon College not able to penetrate as they normally would do with their passes. Sun is extremely hot here at the Fogar Road High School. I'm quite that. Actually, have a tool on both teams. Um, in about three minutes time. Change, 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 so yes, Clarendon College is expected to win this one, but definitely it will not be a walkover game for Clarendon College. You have to fight for this one if you want this one. So yes, Clarendon College uh, being able to put their passes together, but the dominant style of play that they normally show, you are not seeing it now, and that is simply because they are playing a central high school team that they are actually not going to allow them to set the pass up front, looking for the number 7, controlled perfectly. So number four, looking for someone in the box. Not seeing anyone back to the attacking midfielder number eight there. There is a central eye. So as you can see, why Central get the ball there, all aim is to attack. Right, so yes, Clarendon College are putting the passes together, but in terms of in definite dangerous position in front of the goal, they are not given that chance. Just not given them that chance by this Central High school team still carrying on college midway the central half. 
searching for that first goal. And um, this goalkeeper for Central I must be commended because of the way he is reading the ball, actually at the right spot at the right time. He's actually reading the game well. Uh, of course, in terms of ball position, Clarion and College, and um, I would have watched Central I play in Glenmore, similar game where Glenmore was actually knocking the ball around. Um, Central I not getting a lot of the ball, but once Central I get the ball, then they actually attack the goal. So it's quite sure that Central is used to this um, type of football where they are not able to knock the ball as they would like, but once they get the hold of the ball, they definitely make use of it. The um, good thing about this from a central ISO perspective is that they would have not allowed Clarendon Pines to score an early, early goal. So at least they score still 0 0 both teams are level now, 23 minutes of play. I'm quite sure that um, the referee is going to indicate to the dressing room or to the bench asking teams to take a water break and they're going to actually water break now. So zero zero after twenty four minutes of play. All right. So resuming after the water break, so both teams would have been allowed to graduate. Sound extremely warm at the Foga Road High School here. Central High School would have thrown uh, midway the Clarendon College. Uh, again, after uh, twenty four minutes of play. The score is still locked at 0-0, um, zero, zero. so again it is quarter-final um, match between Clarendon College and Central High School. Much being recorded by Femitech, so again for persons who are new to the YouTube channel, definitely you need to click on that subscription button. Yeah, I'm going to go to the to go to the to there is Clarendon College dangerously in front of the goal, but So Central ice with a corner kick. So I think this is the first corner of the game. So Central Ice would have uh, corner kick across the goal. Would corner kick actually hit the crossbar. So not a bad attempt. So um, Central would have hit the crossbar with that corner kick. As you can see, the flight of the ball was actually dipping. I'm quite sure that if that um, went exact to goal, the goalkeeper would have experienced some form of difficulty in getting that one out of the net. Yeah. 
So again, um, the score is still 0 0. Um, Central High School would have hit the crossbar from a corner kick. So central looking dangerous at the moment, putting some pressure on this Clarendon College unit. Right, so central team actually won a shot to go so the game after what, 20 28 minutes it is still zero zero um both teams looking decent um of course Clarendon has been a better football in terms of passes but since the second uh, since um after the water break realize that the central team actually a bit more composed so uh, definitely that water break talk would have helped uh, would have benefit the central team of course they are applying a bit more pressure So, this central team not allowing um, Clarendon College to settle down. Sorry. Central definitely. in front of board. Free kick here for Clarendon College. Break, Rufi, 
Alright, so um, first off, so first off, option. So again, for those persons who are new to the channel, it is Clarendon College One and Central High School Zero. So after 45 minutes of play, it is Clarendon College in front. So again, please stay tuned for the second half. Again, match being recorded by Fimitech. Clarendon College versus Central High School. So once again, guys, thanks again. Please stay tuned for the second half. Fimitech is out of here.